Hey, glad you could make it over today. Grab some coffee and let's talk about EMS quality. Have you ever heard the term EMS quality police or the chart Nazis? It's kind of a unflattering term that I've heard EMS crews use sometimes uh, to talk about those working in the quality department. And it kind of makes me wonder, how did it get this way? How did the EMS quality department get such a bad reputation? And I think it goes back several decades, actually. Traditionally, EMS has modeled the way it does quality after how the hospitals did it. Back in the day, hospitals were focused on trying to use quality as a way of reducing their risk from lawsuits. And the way they would go about that is having someone review the charts to identify problems or errors, then point those issues out to the staff members that were involved, and then try to fix those staff members by having them reread the policies and procedures or protocols, maybe get some additional education, maybe some additional supervision. It's as if the hospitals were defining quality as the absence of unquality. It's like the quality department at the hospital perceived this like a barrel with a couple bad apples in it. And the way to improve hospital quality was either to fix those bad apples or get rid of them entirely. Now, I think generally speaking, hospitals have matured past this bad apples philosophy, but unfortunately, I think there's still quite a few EMS agencies that haven't. And I think this stems from the fact that a lot of EMS crews don't hear from the quality department until they find something wrong with what they did and they get called out on it. And I think this is where that uh, EMS quality police or chart Nazi terminology tends to come from. But there's really a far better and more effective strategy to use in managing quality in EMS and healthcare and enterprise in general. And it really comes from the industrial sector. A long time ago, they discovered that these types of bad apples approaches were not particularly effective. They were even counterproductive. And this is where the modern industrial quality model came from. And the strategy here is that when a problem is identified, the focus isn't on fixing the worker involved, it's about discovering what was wrong with the process and trying to fix the process. Really dig in deeper and try to identify what were the circumstances or what was the root cause of why the problem even occurred in the first place. Then instead of putting the blame or responsibility on the worker for why the problem occurred, they enlist the worker to work with a quality improvement team to try to identify exactly what went wrong, what the circumstances were, and ask that worker for insights and ideas they may have on how to change the process to make it less likely for the error to occur anytime in the future. And that's the big change. The emphasis is shifted to trying to fix the process to make it less prone to error and not trying to find fault with the staff. People don't come to work with the intent of doing the job poorly. EMS professionals recognize that the work they do is important and matters in the lives of the patients they care for and the communities they serve. So don't treat crews like it's their shortcomings that caused the problems. EMS quality managers should look at these problems like windows, windows that provide a new view about the process and that new view can reveal different ways to improve the process, to make it stronger and less likely to have those kinds of errors occur in the future. And some of this may sound familiar if you read about Just Culture organizational programs because the industrial quality model and Just Culture share a lot of those ideas in common. And that approach will really go a long way towards repairing the reputation of EMS quality programs that have kind of lagged behind adopting the modern industrial quality model and just culture organizational models. So give that a little bit more thought while you finish up your coffee and then go out and try something.